G'day guys, Corey here, and today I thought I'd try something a little special inside of a Thermaltake Corpy 5 case. Now I wanted to build a higher end system and I really want a nice custom water cooling loop. The motherboard we're gonna be using is the Aorus Extreme Z590 Water Force. Now this comes with its own monoblock, so it's gonna look really nice in the system and keep the CPU nice and cool. Speaking of the CPU, we have Intel's flagship 11900K, eight cores and 16 threads, which is gonna be plenty for gaming. The GPU of choice is the Asus 3080 Strix. This is a beefy GPU and we're going to be blocking it not only on the bottom, but on the top as well, because we have the EK water blocks, water block and active backplate. It's gonna keep it nice and cool. So with all that being said, let's go ahead and get on building this gaming PC. Oh, but speaking of gaming. I hereby invite you mortals to raid alongside of my mighty clan in the realms of the Shadow Legends. I'll take it from here. Raid is the first game to bring a true console level experience to your phone, which is the exact reason why I got so many people hooked to it, including myself. Use my links below to download Raid yourself to your phone or your PC. Besides the stunning graphics, Raid also offers a ton of in-game events, champion combinations and countless tactics as you take on raid bosses, dungeon runs, campaign battles, PvP arena matches and more. I started playing the game about half a year ago and so far I managed to collect quite a few epic and legendary champions. My personal favourites are Kale, Martyr and Lanicus the Chosen who form a great team and kick ass in any in-game activity. And unlike many other YouTubers, mine are actually maxed out in level, skills and artifacts. There's huge new updates coming next month and Raid also has released five amazing new champions. And there are special fusion events to get a brand new legendary champion. Please consider using the QR code or the link below to support our channel. The brave souls who sign up will receive a crazy head start in Raid. You'll get an epic hero, Chanaru, 200k silver, one XP boost, one energy refill, and one ancient shard so you can summon an awesome champion as soon as you get in game. All this treasure will be waiting for you here and will be available for the next 30 days and only for new players. I'll see you there. This is the Thermaltake Core P5 and we've been meaning to do a build in this for quite a while. This case traditionally can fit a 480 millimeter radiator, I believe it is. We've got a single 360, but I want to add a second 360 to the system if possible, because I'd love to run two loops to make a really clean water-cooled PC, but we're also going to be painting this case and doing a bit of customization. So let's go ahead and get this thing unboxed and we'll see how it looks. Here we have the Intel Core i9 11900K. This is Intel's flagship processor going into this system. It's got eight cores, 16 threads, so it's gonna be great for gaming. Let's get this thing unboxed, and geez, I wish this case came apart a lot easier.
This is the new G-School Trident Z Royal Elite, and I cannot wait to put these in the system. They've got a new design to them, and it looks really amazing. This is a 32 gigabyte set, running at 3600 megahertz, CL16 timings. So let's get these all out and unboxed. This is the ASUS RTX 3080 Strix, and we haven't had a chance to play around with this card yet, so I'm very excited to actually get this unboxed and have a play around with it. We're actually gonna be water blocking this, not only with the normal water block, we're actually putting an active backplate on it as well. So let's go ahead and get this unboxed, and we'll get it into the system. Now this is the Quantum Vector GPU water block and I'm super excited to be able to put one of these on our graphics card, especially since now we have the active backplate as well. We've never used one of these before, so I'm super excited. We're gonna be unboxing the active backplate next. It's gonna look really good in this system, so let's get this unboxed.
Here we have an EK Quantum Kinetic FLT unit. This has a D5 pump inside. We're actually gonna be putting two of these inside of the loop because we wanna run a dual loop, one for the CPU and one for the GPU. We're gonna have them on both sides of the motherboard and we're gonna create an awesome tube run with them. So let's get these unboxed. So we've got two loops, so we need two radiators. Two 360 millimeter radiators from EK. These are the SE360s, and they're actually going on the Corpy 5 back panel, and I've actually already drilled out the holes and the mounting positions for these radiators, one for each loop. Let's go ahead and get them both unboxed. Now I know I said I was going with the Cooler Master Prismatic fans, but we just got these Leon Lee Uni fans in today. They're the brand new AL120s, so I really wanted to give these a go inside the build. Now these are the white ones, so let's go ahead and get these out. And so far these look absolutely amazing. 